Okay, this next property is down here in Louisville. It's a duck hunting property with a huge home. It's a two-story home, and uh, you got fishing rights. One membership comes with it out of 30 memberships, folks. And uh, what a nice place. I think you'll like this one. Holly Mound Duck Hunting Club is located east of Texarkana, about 26 miles. This 930-acre hunting club is owned by 30 members, and one of the coveted memberships is available for sale along with a two-story home. If I'm, a, if I'm a member out here, do I have to come out here and clear my own thing, get everything? What, do I, what, no, you just you, you just pay whatever dues you have to pay and show up and you bring your own gun you and handle sales. It. You handle it. We keep the woods trails clean, take care of the water. Uh, you come to a clubhouse up here, there's fire, coffee, TV, bar. You just, you take care of yourself. I mean, you provide your own motor and your own decoys. Right. Other than that, we even have boats. Wow, you can come out. You here. provide your own side by side. You can hunt flooded timber. You can hunt flooded rice fields. Now, as a member, you uh, how many days can you hunt if you're the if you're the member? <laughs> you can hunt it all. Yeah, I have guys that hunt every day. Now, then, you know, folks, what makes a, a, a hunting club besides the water? You got to have the water and you got to have timber for them ducks to get in. But you guys got rice field. Tell me about the rice field situation out there. How's that work? We have a lease agreement with people that own some of the fields. They allow us to flood 500 acres. And we've got wells. I mean, the fields aren't going to be dry. If Mother Nature can't do it, we can do it. All right, now here is the kind of the layout of Holly Mound Duck Hunting Club. All this land here belongs to you. This is a big lake. Forgot how big it is, but it's huge. We'll look at it here in a minute. This lake is used as a reservoir to flood the timber if there's not a water, enough water in the timber. Here's your duck hunting area right here. Rice fields, this is where, the, this is where it all happens right here. That's the reason you have ducks uh, come in here. Red River is right here, folks. This is Red River. Uh, and if anybody studied Arkansas, this is in the, uh, the Arkansas Duck Flyway. There's more mallard ducks come through here than anywhere in the world. Okay, folks, this property is located to just just feet away from a hundred and something acre private lake loaded with bass, uh, crappie, and brim, uh, all the fishing you can do. Folks, you have year-round fishing right out the back door. You can have guests spend the night at the lake house and fish all day. Largemouth bass up to eight pounds are caught. You'll never have a bad day fishing. Kids catch brim, sun perch, and crappie right off the boathouse deck. Now this is the back of the home. It's a two-story home. Huge deck out the back overlooking the lake. Let's go in and look at this place. When you come in the back door here, everything is solid glass, double, uh, double pane glass here to where you can see the, the beauty of the lake and the trees here. And then of course, when you have a cabin or a home like this on a lake, you want plenty of preparation area and enter for entertaining here. You've got a nice bar here, um, another, another preparation a sink over here. And then what makes it really cool is looking back at the fireplace. Okay, leaving the kitchen wide open is your living room here. Fireplace and way tall ceilings. They're probably close to 19 foot ceilings. And you walk on out here, you got your own sunroom. Now from the front door, you walk right in into the living room kitchen that way. Now then back here, upstairs here, Back here is a laundry room, mud room, leading out into the uh, double carport. And over 
here is a downstairs bedroom. Now, of course, when you uh, walk upstairs, the first thing you see is solid glass from top to bottom, overlooking the views of your private lake. Then the master suite sits over here to the right, complete with fireplace. Walk on through, you got jetted tub, shower, huge area for a closet back there, double sink vanity. Even got a refrigerator back here, folks. Okay, now across from the suite over there, you got another small bedroom back on this side. You walk down the hallway here, you got a full bath on your left. You got a, another bedroom here, which they're actually using for a study right now, but it, it, is a, it is a bedroom. Then you walk on down here, you got another set of bunks and uh, slash office. This is where the previous owner was uh, had his office when he come up here to enjoy his time at the lake. Okay, what is so neat here and, and just being out here walking, you got your own trail um, deck made out of wood all the way down from the home down to the water. It must be close to 100 yards up there. But look here, folks, you got your, uh, you got your own private boat stall opening up into this massive lake. Uh, you got coolers here to put your life jackets and all your stuff for your boat. Uh, sun and uh, sun and area out here. And here's what's cool because you catch a lot of fish. You got your own fish cleaning area with water coming out of the, the lake. But look at this, the view out there, covered heavy duty um, uh, boat cover out here. You know, another thing that's very valuable when you're on a uh, property way up in the woods, especially a hunting property with a home in this class on a lake, is uh, they lose power during the mildest of storms. Well, not anymore. You got your own gas propane generator that comes on automatically. Big one too. This will service the whole home.